of after some discussion, we'll be more open with okay. the, the types of genres that we'll be exploring as a team. Mm -hmm. I think that what will be what will be determining the the types of books that will be uh, published mm -hmm. and would be the submissions that that we would be receiving mm -hmm. from 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 for, uh, the aspiring authors. So we didn't want to limit. Uh, we really didn't want to limit the types of stories that would be submitted, but we did want to to point out that because our objective is to grow readership and people who read books, that we would be on the lookout for for uh, for more uh, popular themes, no? for for uh, for themes that resonate with uh, uh, a lot of readers. Um, we will go with our feel um, for what a good story is. Yes. Mm -hmm. Pers perspective on that. What is the kind of story? Para hindi malimit, di ba? Para okay. hindi, right. hindi kami nakakamon sa isang genre lang. Tuto so, na niluwala kami na kung isa niya kung sabi nila na matas yung magagawa mong popular yung appeal nyo, eh. mas kina man ng subject matter o ni siyang ka, magagawa mo ng paraan na magkapil sa sa Market. Market. Mm -hmm. Hindi market. Mm -hmm. uh, yeah, um, uh, right now, wala sanang limit kasi ako galing ako sa online platform. Mm -hmm. Kung alam ninyo lahat, libre yun. Pero kung doon ka, doon kayo masyado, doon kayo nagbababad at nagbabasa, makikita nyo na yung mga kabataan, iba-iba yung mga gusto nila. So kahit sino, hindi na talaga nila ma-determine. Like, isa sa successful yung kaibigan ko nagsulat ang I Love You Since. Sobrang ganda na kwento nyo. Sino makakapag-akala na yung gusto pa na nilang kwento ay siya nagbabalik sa lumang panahon? Mm -hmm. Who would know? Merong isa pa na nagaling sa space. Merong erotic romance. Wala tatali nyo na mga kabataan na yun. And this is a good opportunity na marami kami ma-invite ng mga, mga batang or new generation of writers. It doesn't have to be bata. It doesn't have to be um, um, bago. Pwede rin yung mga nangangarap na makapagpasa sila sa ESPN publishing. Sir yeah, The fastest growing segment in publishing is inspirational publishing, mm -hmm. inspirational books. So, me, especially I'm looking for uh, writers or authors who still believe that miracles still happen, mm -hmm. that heroes still exist, and that good people can still be winners. So, yun ang hinahanap ko Thank you so much. Our first question will come from Ginyo Krishnan of TV Patra. Uh, okay. Um, first of all, well, congratulations, of course, for um, your project forward. This having up with Akanina. But um, can you um, just let us know how does it feel to be doing this all together? Kailala po kayo sa mga sa field kung ito na talaga ng patataas and then pinagsama-sama po kayo to actually do this. How does it feel? I feel so excited. I'm looking forward to learning from the masters. Um, yeah. Um, we can. I have collaborated on a number of works, you know, some sa cinema and books. Yeah. And, yeah. And, and television. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So, um, again, this will be a learning experience for me. And now that I'm working with Maki and Arlene, I'm sure that I'll be able to learn. Okay. Thank you. 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 Thank Estudyante ako kay Sir Rini sa Rebelde class last year. So, sobrang ayun na ako. Tapos, si Michelle, of course, I'll be working with her. Sobrang, ano, sobrang saya po. It, it's not also for me, just for me lang. I'm very happy with the opportunity kasi isa ako sa dating nangarap na ma-publish ang ganito kalaking publishing. So, ngayon may babahagi na namin. Magkakaroon na kami ng chance na bahagi yung Dream come true. It's a dream come true. Uh, yeah, so Ricky, I mean, if I weren't joining this, I would join so I could be mattered by you. <laughs> yeah, and, and so that's how uh, big an opportunity this is really for 
for readers who want to become writers. Uh, and it's really, I mean, no panahon namin, wala pang, wala pang kando eh. So it's the first reading of Philippine Publishing. So it's so exciting to be part of this. Okay, well, next question is about still about Project Forward. How is this going to happen? Because it's going to happen for six months. Or uh, these hmm. mentors will guide the participants for six months. So, how will this happen? Will they have to do classes? Well, the program would run for at least 18 months. Okay. But within the first six months, uh, we've set a target of publishing uh, the first books from from the initial batch of mentees. So we would like to target to publish at least four books by September 2020. Uh, so we would be having a, a workshop, but also I, each mentor would uh, would at the pace at their own pace at the pace of the writer be mentoring uh, the, the writer. Okay. okay, our next question was um, on Daniel's question. Um, can you give us more details on what um, the attendees or participants can expect from the workshop? Like, um, what kind of lessons there will be? One on one sessions, of course, but um, can you give us more details on how the workshop will be? Like? Not yet. We, we still uh, to finalize uh, the, the, the content of the workshop. But I think that the magic here would really be on the one on one, uh, the, the mentorship of, of the individual writers. And then, will there be workshops on Filipino writing as well, not just English? Yeah. Uh, definitely, uh, we because the submissions would be open to not just English manuscripts but also uh, Filipino. And it will be open to people of all ages as long as they are Definitely. Oh, thank you. Interesting.